I had some pretty good luck asking for plant identification the other day and uh, some people were able to tell me what this plant was over here. And I'm extremely grateful. It turns out to be a weed, but it's a beautiful weed. It uh, produces purple flowers and they bloom a couple at a time. Sorry about the noise, but uh, my neighbors are always running some kind of a device. <laughs> some kind of a pressure washer or something. So over here I've got my tobacco and I wanted to ask another question for all of you as well as to show you something about the tobacco. Um, I mentioned about pinching the tops off and I just wanted to show you what they look like as they're blooming. So this right here is a tobacco head about to go into bloom. You can see the yellow flowers just starting to come out and uh, when it's finished it'll be beautiful but if you let it go too long and it seeds then you kind of lose the growth off the leaves so anyhow I pinched all of these off just wanted to show you just basically come in here like this just simply pinch off the top and that'll promote more leaf growth and these are actually are ready to be harvested some of these larger leaves and they say you often harvest from the bottom up these bottom leaves um, they, they call them mud leaf or a sand leaf. It's uh, s several different terms. They're basically where the splatter from the, uh, you know, the rain covers the leaf. So you tend to leave those as kind of a protector. But I didn't plant any of this tobacco. <laughs> you can see there's some over here in the lettuce. There's some over there. Some over there in the peas. They're just everywhere and uh, some behind the corn and the flowers. All of these just popped up out of the blue, so I just let them grow. But there's one plant that I wanted to help I, you help me identify if you can, and I had two of them come up. This is the plant right here. Now, when it first popped up, I'm gonna do a little research on this too, but uh, I thought it was an avocado. And then it started growing and it has a really thick stem. I'm gonna assume it's some sort of a weed but interestingly enough I've just never seen anything like it so I don't have any flowers or buds yet it looks like it has alternating stem growth and a very reddish stem with uh, growth between the nodes and it looks like it's starting to bud I didn't even notice that okay so we might end up with an answer here pretty soon I guess we'll find out. If anybody knows ahead of time, let me know. Thanks for coming along.